latest news which is coming in uh, a tragedy has narrowly averted as uh, one of the bbmp nursery school which was in a bad condition and was housing about 80 students it crumbled overnight in bengaluru the incident took place at the bharti nagar uh, area in bengaluru where this particular nursery school of the bbmp and its building this collapsed overnight the locals alleged that they had requested the authorities multiple times to renovate the building but the request had fallen on deaf ears more than 80 students are said to be studying at the nursery school kids children um, uh, you know whose line could uh, whose life could have been threatened had this tragedy really god forbid had happened say during daytime when the children are at the nursery uh, let's listen in to what one of the residents said then i'll con uh, connect with my colleague akshara three hours student incident ATM calls of Taida Rail, ninety admission to Kondida Rail students, so ATM calls of Otaida Rail, Belega parents Bando, Wapas, Takonogi, Makalaga, Nami School Bidogi Danta. E condition Iro, Yella, E area the Lioro report Madida, BBMP Aro report Madida, Auro Iga, Yella, Engineer Guru Bandida, now Kelra Auro, Area Engineer Malak Taida, our Area Engineer Yen Elta, Illa Education Department responsible is the care. Sorry, the alternate Jaga could be to demolish Madi. Reconstruction Marbeka Giro to school. I school only, he conditioned his school only. You are Britta Law, Makalake, Hoda K, Umba, Pugata, Saridu, Tumba, you know, eighty students, Makalu, Jivana, Hokbeka Gituaga. Joining us on the broadcast, um, Akshara, I mean, I don't know what to say, but a huge tragedy has been averted. The fact that the BBMP knew that this building is in a bad condition still did not do anything about it. It's a big question mark on the civic authorities and the administration. Which the time when you get to witness such tragic incidents where you know a two lives were claimed because of the metro pillar clash, and very recently we had a mother and daughter who lost their lives because they came in contact with the bus from where they are not able to. And uh, uh, amidst all these tragic incidents that are coming to the fore because of the civic apathy in Bengaluru, another major uh, tragedy is averted here. I remember in this particular school, more than 80 students were studying, so that's what they were getting to learn from the local test and then. If we get, uh, if you take a look at the visuals there, the whole uh, school building has collapsed, the wall has collapsed, all the two vehicles nearby. And uh, fortunately, it took place during the night, late night at 2 a.m. If it had taken place uh, at, uh, during this daytime, uh, another major uh, tragedy could affect by the city, and now uh, it's a, a PBMP nursery school, you know, small children come here and study. So that's the uh, situation here. And the locals also say that when they phone up most officials, they point fingers at the education department. And the education department says it's the BBMP and other engineer who is responsible. So it's a blame game which is going on here. So that's what the residents have to say regarding this. Once again, it is high time that, you know, uh, major focus should be the civic uh, infrastructure of Bengaluru and ensure that the citizens of this particular IT city are safe here in Bengaluru. All right. Thank you, Akshara, for putting all of that into perspective for us.